I'm standing outside the caravan park here at Fintorn, and what you can see behind me is a very beautiful Fintorn Bay. I'm going to be doing a reading today from a being that Dorothy McLean identified as the landscape angel. And this is what it had to say that particular time. When you turn to us without a practical specific question, you can simply let go and rise to the bubbling joy which we are and let that particular energy fertilize the whole of your being. This is our gift, the emphasis we have for humanity at the moment, and it is far more important than any information that we might give to your minds. In this field, your problems have a way of being erased, and you can flow in a stream of delight, which is guidance in itself. This energy is so strong that nothing diverts you or puts you off course and you can see everything from a different perspective. Humanity could become much more stable in this higher consciousness, and all who come become stabilized help the whole, for this consciousness contains no sense of personal gain, only a sharing of the whole. Your minds still question. Let go. Let our joy explode. All that, mat all that matters will fall into place, and you will know without thinking, easily. Drop the burdens of separateness and all striving to gain knowledge, and come into the omnipotence of the whole. Know that all knowledge is yours as and when you need it, for the divine is within you and knows what you need. And the divine includes human as well as Davic wisdom. All is yours. All is for all. Let us unite. So again, the invitation is extended to us to work in cooperation and co-creation with these other forms of intelligence that are part of the planet. And one of the, the perks of being willing to engage with that and begin to do that is to share in the joy of the flow of life. In this year, 2021, joy of life may well be something it would serve all of us to cultivate for ourselves, for our families, for our neighborhoods, for the sake of humanity and the planet. So let's see what we can do to bring more joy into the times we are facing. Until the next time, bye for now.